Hello everybody, we are back here on the Hunter Classic and today we are going to be doing the Halloween event which is the werewolves as a lot of you probably know by now. If you're new to Classic, this will probably be the first time that you'll have played with the werewolves and they are a ton of fun. I did a little bit of messing around with them because this actually is the first year that I've done the Halloween event. It's the first year that I've really been as into Classic as I am right now, so it's really nice to finally get to experience it and from the little bit that I've done, it's pretty fun. But today I think what we're going to be doing is trying to complete the mission, which which right here it's find a green, blue, red, purple, and Dia de Muertos skull. So we're going to try and get all those and then we have to harvest a werewolf with a shot to the brain or skull. And we get some gems, Halloween ritual of skulls trophy, and a two-person tree stand. The main reason I'm doing these is I want those two-person tree stands because that's going to be really, really nice to have. It's one of the few times that you actually get to... Uh, earn these as rewards for a quest so I figured this will be a pretty good time to do that and go hunt some werewolves at the same time since I've had quite a few of you guys asking me if I'm gonna do anything with the werewolves so let's get into it so for those of you that have never done the Halloween event on the hunter classic it is on Timbergold trails and as you can see it's at nighttime which makes it very very interesting and a little bit scary at times but Basically, the only thing that you can use to kill them is either the 308 handgun with the silver 308 bullets or the Wolfsbane crossbow pistol, which is also with the silver crossbow bolts. Uh, but yeah, the only 308 that can do it is the Wolfsbane one. Currently, as I'm making this video, it's on sale for 100 M's, which is going to be really helpful for anybody that's trying to play this event. But anyway... We'll probably change our clothing up a little bit and then get out and hunt them. Alright, I'm liking the way that looks, except, uh... That, yeah, it's gonna be a problem. We're probably gonna have to remove that, but, uh... Overall, it looks okay. Alright, so I think we're just gonna go with this for now. We'll try out the Jason mask, since I did end up purchasing that, because it was on sale. So, let's head out and try to find ourselves some werewolves. Oh, that's a werewolf. Let's hope we are able to actually take this out. We're in a pretty decent area. So I think we should be okay, but honestly, anything can happen and it could catch us by surprise. But I think we should be able to take this guy out before he gets us. I probably should have grabbed med kits, but I wasn't really thinking. I think what we'll do is once we end up dying we'll just grab the med kits from there but until then we're just gonna have to deal with not having any on us oh yeah we're definitely gonna have one running at us soon this is about to get interesting oh yep here we go that was not the best shot but hopefully that second one took it down Oh, that is another one. Uh, let's go ahead and mark where this was. Just so we can come back to it, because... We do have this other one over here now. That's another one. Okay, so we have two. Maybe even three. Uh, uh, oh, <laughs> this is... Yeah, this is not good for us. We are probably going to die. Oh, yeah. Here comes one. And that was not as good of a shot as I hoped. I don't think we got that one good. Hopefully we can get another shot on it. Yeah, we're definitely not going to be able to. Uh, we did end up hitting it, though. But that does look like body blood, so... Not off to a great start at all, so. Uh oh. Oh no, this was. Oh my gosh, there's so many of them. I think, I think that's an albino one, hold on. I, th I think that was an albino one. 
Hold on. Was that an albino? I think it was. I think we actually found an albino one. I think he's bugged though. That's unlucky if he is. Uh oh. Oh, could not get on that one in time. This has been an interesting time. We're uh, burning through our camping supplies and... <sighs> oh man. <laughs> well, might be a little bit before we figure out what that was. I am going to grab the med kits now. That was a terrible decision to not bring them in the first place, but at least it's been interesting. <laughs> and right here is actually one of the skull collectibles we need, so that's nice. We got the blue skull. So that's one of them. We got quite a few more to find still. I think there's four others that we have to find. So hopefully we can do that before the end of the day. It'd be nice if we could complete it. But I think what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to let the next one kill me. That way I can get over to the albino one or the one that we think is albino it could have just been the lighting but it really did look like it was so I'm gonna let this next one kill me and then we will head over there here it is all right fast travel uses up three camping supplies but it'll be worth it here it is let's see is this an albino I think it has to be Oh yeah, that definitely is. That definitely, yep, albino. Let's go, 309 albino at that. So, not too bad at all. And we do have the trophy shop poses. So that's gonna be really, really cool. Literally, the first one that we actually get to claim is an albino. So, I think what we're gonna do here is, we'll go with a casual, or actually, even better, we'll go to the serene one and all right so we will go with that right there I like that that is pretty good looking I'm really surprised that we got one let's taxidermize that guy because that's really really cool we got ourselves an albino and we've barely even been playing now we did kill this one over here so we do have one more to claim and then we'll continue searching around for some more. I don't remember if this was a male or a female. I just remember shooting this one and then seeing the albino. But it sounds like we do have more around here. So let's grab this quickly. This one is just a female. A 269. So let's get ready for the two that are about to come over here. Because that is another one actually. That didn't go as planned. Um, well, it's going to take me a while to get used to this. And that is another werewolf. Let's hopefully not completely miss on this one. All right, here it comes. Should be a hit. Hopefully it was a good one. Uh, probably not. It's looking like that wasn't super great. It's hard to tell though with the werewolves. We'll try to track this guy down just to see. Oh, there is the green skull we need. So there we go. Got our green skull. And there is another one. It's actually down by the water, I think. Okay, this is going to be a little easier to at least see it. We'll probably just try to stay out in this field. Then we should have a pretty clear view of it coming at us. Alright, here it comes. Interesting. Not actually sure what that one was doing, but there was no way I was going to hit that. Oh my god. Gosh, that does not sound nice at all. That is a lot of them. Oh, this is going to get really rough. I'm going to go ahead and put a fresh box in because I don't... I don't want to be caught with just one and then forget to put another box in because I've definitely done that before and it wouldn't end well at all. Oh, 
Oh, it's the end of us. No. <laughs> My gosh. Okay, so we got that one. Is that... Are you, are you kidding me? Are... Are you kidding me? We got another one. And this one's a female. <laughs> what is happening? This is absolutely insane. My first time playing... In the Halloween event, and we have a second albino in the same hunt. Well, technically not the same hunt because I did end up restarting, but that is insane. So within two sessions, we have two albinos. I can't believe that. That's absolutely insane. All right, I'm liking that actually. That looks really good. So that is perfect right there. Let's let's tax that one too. Why not? That is absolutely awesome. Definitely not what I expected, but that's really, really cool. And then this one right here is just a female 273. So there was a couple more around here. I don't think we're gonna see them over here yet. We might have to run around and try to find them again, but at least we're finally dropping some on the spot. I just needed a little practice, I guess. And right there is another green skull. So we already have a green one. This isn't gonna help us with the mission, but Still good to grab them. I honestly would have been happy with just one albino, but the fact that we found two of them is more than I ever expected out of this event. I'm still sad that the male was bugged, but at least we managed to get that female uh, with her actually charging at us. So that was pretty cool. It does seem like we have another. Actually, multiple. And we're definitely getting a little better than we were. Let's go ahead and grab this real quickly. Uh, this one is a male. It is a 331, so that is our best one so far. So, not too bad. We're not going to do anything with the trophy shot, though. Probably not going to trophy shot unless we get one that's at least like 350. But if we get a 350, we'll take a nice trophy shot. And here comes another one. Oh, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? What's happening? What is happening? Where did this guy go? Okay, we have to track that down. I don't know where it went, but... We have to track it down. Oh my gosh. What is happening? This game is absolutely giving me everything I could ever ask for. But the only issue is we're going to have trouble finding which one it is. Oh, we got another coming at us. Don't know where it's going to be. It sounds like it might be stuck. There's a very good chance this one might be stuck. Ah, uh, yeah, this one's definitely stuck. So let's go ahead and take that out. Easy little werewolf kill there, since he's just going to sit there in the tree. And this guy is a female with 246, so nothing crazy there. And this is the albino, actually. Uh, we hit it, but I don't think that's going to kill it. I think that has to be the albino that we saw earlier. So that is cool that we actually got a shot into it. I don't think it was going to die, though. So that's a little unfortunate, but at least we got it leaking and we know which one it is. That was the biggest issue was that I didn't know which track was it. And now we found it finally. So let's go ahead and try to track it down. Hopefully that's the one that we're tracking. It's in the same direction, so... Uh, hopefully this is the one that we wounded would be nice if we could just get it to come at us again and here it comes that is most definitely it I think well we're about to find out it looks like it was so 
yeah, that is our albino. Let's go grab this thing. The fact that we have found three of these things is absolutely insane. I can't believe that. That is ridiculous, honestly. 226 on that one, too. Now, this one died in a pretty bad spot, so we are not going to be able to get a good picture, but just the fact that we even found three is pretty crazy and one of the luckiest things we've had happen in classic in a while now let's just go with this because we really can't get a good picture and uh, we're gonna tax this too I, honestly i'm gonna tax all the albinos we get just so that we can have them because this is like i was saying the first halloween event i've done in classic and i feel like it's not normal to find three albinos within about 40 minutes of recording so that's definitely pretty lucky i like i was saying i did one session uh last night actually and i had two or three werewolves down uh but nothing was of any size and i was getting absolutely slaughtered kind of like i was at the beginning of this video but i definitely feel like it's not normal to get three albinos within 40 minutes so that's definitely really really cool let's see if we can find anything else i would like to get a decent sized one so We'll try to get a bigger one, and if we can't, then I guess we'll call it at that, but I would prefer if we could get something of decent size, and that is actually another green skull, so we've been finding a ton of the green ones, but none of the ones that we need for the mission. Alright, here it comes. We definitely hit it. And hopefully that was vitals. I think it might actually be stuck. Either that or it died. One of the two. Yeah, it's definitely stuck. Definitely got stuck. So let's just go up and finish this guy off so that we don't have to worry about tracking it anymore. And that did not kill it off like I was hoping it would, so we are going to have to do a third one. Oh my gosh, this thing is invincible. These things are tough if you don't hit them good. My gosh. Alright, this is probably going to go bad, but I'm going to try and get closer. gosh talk about a tough werewolf <laughs> talk about a tough werewolf we hit it in everything it seems spine stomach intestine hip bone right leg hip bone hip bone shoulder blade right lung shoulder blade shoulder blade neck neck bone three and body right lung how did this thing survive that many shots i can't believe it took that many shots just to take that thing down so I think what we're going to do is I'm going to use up these last four bullets and whatever we get with those is what we will have for the video. So hopefully something decent will come along within these next four shots. That is not what I was expecting to hear, but uh, good to know that not all the deer are spooked off by these werewolves. There we go. Finally, another one. Oh, another two actually this is not how i was hoping to find more but guess we're just gonna have to deal with it and hope that we come out alive because this very well could go wrong and a third one man they are not making it easy on us and <laughs> I, I don't even know what to say anymore I am just absolutely mind blown at the fact that 
Of course that would happen. Of course. But for real, what is going on? I have had probably the best luck I'll ever have in these Halloween events. I mean, given they've all been females, pretty much. I mean, that's a decent sized female, but it's absolutely insane. I can't believe it. Oh, this could go bad. Not sure if they can kill me while I'm in trophy shot, but... Well, this is definitely going to be interesting. Let's actually use this to our advantage and try to include that. Okay, I actually really like how that is looking right there. Let's go ahead and just... Get the perfect one. Alright, that looks good right there, so... Let's accept that and taxidermize and then die. Because that is how it would go. Alright, honestly, I don't even need to get these last couple kills with these last couple bullets. I am very, very happy with how this has gone, so let's jump in the lodge and check out the awesome albinos that we got during this. I am still absolutely mind blown that within two sessions, we got four albinos. Three of them in this one, and then one in the previous one. And as far as, from what I've been told, albinos are relatively rare, so I should not be finding this many of them. And this is probably the luckiest thing we'll ever have happen in this game. I don't think we'll ever be able to compete with this luck. Besides maybe the fact that we had the 200 scoring whitetail within like a month of starting to go for it, but other than that, this has to be the luckiest thing that's ever happened to me. And I'm really, really surprised, but very, very happy too. Alright, so yeah, we got a total of four of them, and we have four of the large plaques like this, so let's put all of those there, and this lodge is going to look absolutely decked out now. Oh my gosh, I am absolutely loving the way this is looking. This lodge is really coming together nicely, all because of this Halloween event that has given us four of these albinos, which is still an absolutely insane thing to come across. So I think we'll leave them like that, give them all a little bit different poses. That is really, really cool. So I think we'll go ahead and leave it at that, but I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. This has been one of the most insane things I ever could have imagined happening, and I'm really happy that I was able to share it with you guys. So if you guys are new to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And if you enjoy the video, be sure to hit that like button. If we manage to get to 150 likes, we'll probably try to do some more werewolf videos because I am actually kind of enjoying this. I've been... A little hesitant to do a lot of werewolf content just because it is a lot of repetitiveness of just having werewolves running at you but I actually had a lot of fun and if you guys want to see it again hit that like button and we will try to do another one but that's gonna be it for me I will see you all in the next video peace if you are new here and you are liking what you see, consider subscribing to the channel and turning notifications on. Also, if you want to help the channel grow, be sure to like the video because this alone can help the video and my channel do better. But that's going to be it for me. Peace, my dudes. I hope you all have a fantastic day.